Well, good morning. Today, 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 I feel like taking somebody else's truck. Now, whose truck? I don't know, because it's Thursday, and it's my last day of the week. I'm only here till two. I hope you guys enjoy this video, man. Welcome to Cali Towin. Let's clock in. Thank you. All right. So now, shoot. Now it is officially morning. Sun's out. Truck's out. We got one call for an F-150 that I'm heading to right now, about two minutes away. And then after this, we have an eight, uh, eight o'clock time call. Now, I still don't know what car that is. I didn't check it out, but I was told I got another call after this. So this is only going about a mile and uh, it's a tire issue. So let's go see what's up with it. And sure enough, here he is. Morning. Good morning. What's going hey, you on? Want, you want me to back it up inside? Um. There's more, probably more room to get over there. Yeah, if you, if, I mean, if you can, that'll work as long as we can get it on there. I, I, okay. Um. Yesterday I, I bust, I, I broke loose a couple lug nuts, so can, oh. can we tighten them back up? We can try. I got to check it out. Okay. All right. Let's see. Oh man. Oh, they bent the rim, huh? I just, I, I hit a curb. Oh, dang. Wow. Yeah. It's pretty hard. Yeah. Did the back and the front. Oh, both. Yeah. So back anyway, back. uh they're loose. So I got to tighten them back up. Okay. I got I got a I got it for it. Cool, yeah. Cool, cool. Um Oh, you could be Well, I'm that I would be blocking that. I mean, you can if you could just pull it here and then I oh, could okay. yeah, it'd be easier cuz otherwise I'm going to be crossing this section right here. Whatever you gotta do, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, if we could just uh, straighten it out right here. But well, we gotta anything. tighten it up. I got you. I yep. Are all of them loose? Yeah. That side too? Yeah. Not too bad. Man, that's really hard. Yeah, apparently they can fix it. Oh, well, what they do is they heat it up yeah. and then they hammer it out. But the thing is, once metal gets hot, it's gonna it's not going to be as strong as it used to be. Right. So. So I should carry the, uh, I should put those in the front or back? These? Oh, uh, yeah. The, after I fix it. Um, well, because they got to do the same to that one too, huh? Yeah, uh, well, no, this one, it didn't fuck up the roof like that. Okay. I would say put these in the back just because it's more heavier in the front. Yeah. A lot of money in this damn truck too. <laughs> I bet, man. I just put a $5,000 transmission in it. Oh boy. Well, I mean, at least it's it's just the rims that's going on, yeah, right? I, yeah. I got lucky, brother. Yeah, yeah. And, and maybe I I hope it's not uh. Front end damage. I don't think so. Uh, did you hit something else? No. Uh, I thought I did. I thought it was like five o'clock in the morning, dark. Oh yeah, I don't blame you. <laughs> I thought I hit somebody. That was this. That was today. Uh, no, a couple nights ago. Oh okay. I was taking a friend to work, and all of a sudden, boom. Yeah. I scared the living shit out. Of me. Well, yeah, man, two blowouts. Well, oh yeah, here too. Tires bad too, huh? Yeah, these tires are about two. Man. Three hundred bucks a piece. Still good tread. I know. But If you want to roll it slowly so we can line it up and then I'll just winch it up so you don't have to drive on it.
Go back. What? Go all the way back. All the way back. Can I turn it this way? Still do it. My my uh my friend's gonna let me borrow his car. Okay. So you can follow me, it's right down the street. Yeah, I got the address too. 0.7 miles. kidding when he said it was down the street this thing's a bit uncomfortable but you know what I love it there Manuel's tire shot now where do I drop it that's the question What's up, boss? Can you back it in on that spot right there? Where at? Back it in. Can you back it in right there or no? By the gate? Yeah. Um, it's it, not drivable, is it? Well, it does. Uh, it's just it has two flats on this side because the rims. On this side, there's two flats because the the rims got fucked up. Oh. You're okay. Yeah, you drive just it. Go so. straight and I'll just when you take off, I'll drive it in there. So okay. Me. So okay. just like by the gate? Yeah, drive by the gate. Just dump it. I'll drive it in. All right, brother. Perfect. Thank mm -hmm. you. Now the guy is supposed to be here because he has the key, so I can't, you know, lower it without him here. He's supposed to be here already. Some sound like he's about to go out on this truck. I don't like that. Let's go. You know me, I like to get ready. A lot of people will probably think, man, you wasting a lot of time doing that. Wasting a lot of time just trying to roll these up. But you know what? All I got is time, baby. I'm here for nine hours and I ain't tripping about rushing nothing. That's on me. So I'm gonna do what I gotta do. And also, you gotta stay ready, so you ain't gotta get ready. And that's why I roll my shit up all the time, and I dump it. You did. I always put this in here. Why? Because I don't want no one stealing my shit. That's why. I think that guy with the snap-on jacket um, on my key, so he'll... Okay, yeah, yeah, he spoke to me about it. All He's right. gonna roll it in. All right. Okay, buddy. Right. Are you on the 
it's off. ready to drive off, brother. When oh, you're ready. You. Yeah. Oh, making me do it. Oh, this guy got a lot of dogs. And it's a wrap. All right, Thanks. we're here. All right, buddy. God Ready? bless. Huh? Take care. <sighs> Time to go to the next call, man. I'm gonna see y'all there. So, it's looking like it's this Malibu right here, this gold one. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. All right. We is here, baby. What's going on with your big dog? What happened? You good? Hey, don't worry about it. What, what happened? So, I need a tow because my starter, there's something wrong with my starter. But I just got like... Like you had power though, right? Yeah, but, but better, barely because my battery kind of dead right now. So oh, okay. I'm going to sit it for like a week or two right now. But we can still get it in neutral, okay? Right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Let's do it. So you want the good news or bad news? I don't really care. <laughs> so the good news is I'm here. The bad news is my PTO is not working, so my bed's not going. Damn. Well, I don't need a tow. Um, I need to go back to the yard and get a different fucking truck. Yeah, I know, because I was there uh, for an hour this morning and uh, everyone's truck was locked. So this is so bullshit, yo. All right, well. Okay. Bye bye. All right, so my bed just went out. It's not a. Uh, it's not even moving. So she's gonna send another truck for you. Okay. okay. Not even going in gear right now. Oh, it's not. Yeah. Oh, shit, I was, sucks for both of us. <laughs> but yeah, bro, I gotta head back to the shop. Uh, but she's sending one uh, for you. Okay. All right. Let me try to get it out of gear then. Okay. All right, yep. Damn, damn, damn. See, this is the type of shit I'm talking about, man. See, my PTO's working. Like that, right? Not working. It's on. Still not working. It's trash. That shit's broken. This is hanging off. Bumper's coming off. Look at this. Oh, look, let's not fix this. Let's just put a zip tie on it. This thing flew off. 
but they wanted to hold it with tape. Man, I don't get paid enough for this. Whatever. Let's go back to the shop, y'all. Okay, so I'm heading back to the yard, and um, hopefully I can hop back in another truck. This truck is acting really weird with acceleration. Um, I'm not sure if my transmission is going out or something, but I do remember my PTO was leaking transmission fluid the other day. So I don't know if that's the reason why my PTO is not working, but also my, acceler my acceleration is, is kind of acting weird. So hopefully when we, when we get back to the yard, I can hop in another truck. Otherwise I'm gonna have to cut my day short which honestly, I really don't want to do that. So, let's just hope for the best. Also, my windshield wiper right here is actually, doesn't even have its rubber. That side does, but this side doesn't because the other day when I was uh, driving this in the rain, this side was not clear at all. I could not see out of my windshield. That bottom mirror that's supposed to be helping my blind spot is not the right mirror. Actually, that's for that looks like it's for a small car and they just put it on here. It's cracked and also it doesn't adjust so I can't even really see my blind spot. I can see the bed, I can't see my blind spot. This is the proper mirror right here. That's fine. There's a lot of things wrong with this vehicle, man, and, and or this truck. And I don't, I don't even appreciate the fact that the company doesn't even take care of it properly. But again, this is my life as a tow truck driver, y'all. They're doing stuff they ain't supposed to be doing, and they ain't taking care of the things I need to be taking care of. Everything with this is falling apart. Even this dash cam's not even helping. Where's the wire for it? It's not even on. How is that supposed to save me in the long run? Someone decides they want to take the charger for their cell phone or something else, but they ain't putting it back. Just like how these people are taking keys home. They're not supposed to be taking keys home. But hey, this is life as a tow truck driver. I'm just showing y'all what happens over here in California towing, baby. So truck is up and running again, and uh, the bed is working just fine now. I guess what it was, uh, they thought it was the hydraulic fluid. Well, first they thought it was a transmission fluid, so I had to pour transmission fluid in there, and then. Well, we needed transmission fluid anyways because that thing was really dry. Told me to try it and the bed still wasn't working. Then they thought it was the hydraulic fluid. So we pulled the bed back and that's what you saw. Uh, they had the forklift pull the bed back and you saw all this hydraulic fluid spill out from the bottom of that truck. Very short clip, but if you've seen it, it poured out from the bottom of the truck. It was overflown. There was more than enough hydraulic fluid in there. So it wasn't the hydraulic fluid. Then they noticed that there was a wire that was kind of loose and whatever. And as soon as he moved that, it started working again. So hopefully we don't get this problem again because I didn't really see them work on anything. All they did was move a wire. So it wasn't even worked on to be honest. So let's see, hopefully it's good today. It's good the next time I drive this thing. Hopefully I can get a different truck and I'm not in this thing next time. But uh, right now we're heading back to the area um, that I'm supposed to be working in and uh, right now there's no call, but let's see what we get All right got my snacks Time to head to this call down the street at the supermarket Picking up a Dodge Durango So what we are looking for is a gray Dodge Durango. Sometimes too, it will say that it's a gray Durango, but really it's like a blue Durango, or like a, a red Durango. It's like, it's like, What's going on, fellas? What's going on, man? What's going on? Yeah. What's going on? What happened? I see you get a tow. What happened? I, I need a tow. Oh, it's my fuel pump. Does it start though? It almost wants to kick over. But it won't kick over? No, I like car, watch, I, I talk. What happened? I need you. I need your card. Oh, I don't have a card. It's AAA. Oh, that's all. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay. No, I don't. I know. It's all good. It starts? Yeah. Does it drive? Yeah, it's going to drive. Uh, do you want me to cancel it or not? Yeah, cancel it. I'll be, okay, but you I'm sure? Fine. I'm positive. All right, man. <laughs> you you straight, you. bro. All right, be easy. Hey, y'all have a good day, fellas. was the cancel his car started i don't know what's up with it man but i mean if that's happening to your car if you calling us because your car isn't working it's not starting and then when i pull up and start one of two things one you are stupid and you don't you didn't know what you was doing at the time of trying to start it or two you need to go get that shit checked out because even if it started now, it might die on you before you get home or when you get home. So, man, 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 the type of stuff that you see during these calls sometimes is a no-brainer. Okay, 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 so this is how we did. So in total, we have five calls. Three of them canceled, two of them were successful. So again, average four to five calls a day. Um, today is Thursday. But the way that my schedule works is that today is my Friday, which means I am off tomorrow and Saturday, and I'll be back Sunday afternoon. So Sunday afternoons around 3 o'clock is when I start, and I get off at 9. So um, nine, that's 9 o'clock at night. Um, so, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this ride along, man. This is only the second video. I'm going to be trying to keep up with this every single day with my GoPro camera. Um, that way you guys can see the different challenges and if you're a tow truck driver yourself or if you work for AAA any experience or maybe you were a former tow truck driver like comment and subscribe let me know your experience maybe there's something that I could learn off of you maybe there's something that you could learn off of me my name is Josh this is the Cali Towing Channel thank you for joining me for a ride along let's clock out <laughs>